The $1.9 trillion stimulus will send billions to Minnesota in direct payments to families, child care assistance, and aid to state and local governments. But the bill also earmarks billions for vaccine rollout and testing. WCCO's Caroline Cummings is live at the vaccination clinic at Mall of America and explains how that money will help. Caroline. This vaccination site here at Mall of America is one of a few permanent state community testing sites that they say will help get more shots in arms on a larger scale. And health officials say it's all made possible by federal aid and more of it will keep the process of vaccine rollout moving along. Minnesota is poised to get $7.5 billion for vaccine efforts in that plan, Senator Tina Smith says. And she joined Governor Tim Walz and Senator Amy Klobuchar and others in the Minnesota congressional delegation on Monday to tout the latest federal stimulus plan. They say funds will help ensure everyone who wants a vaccine, regardless of insurance will have access and health commissioner Jan Malcolm says money will help get vaccines to all communities. The vaccine does no good in the vial. It's got to get delivered to people. This is the one of the most complex operations in public health in our in our history um, and we can't do it without the support the people and the and the uh, and the infrastructure to get the vaccines administered. So this is going to just accelerate um, our recovery from this pandemic. Now, the $7.5 billion the state will get for vaccine efforts is on top of other targeted programs, including money for state and local governments. And right now, more than 20% of Minnesotans have at least one shot. Shayla. All right, Caroline reporting. Thank you so much for that information.